venture into the old town yet. I'm just looking for food. Just ordered kalab noodle and a special herbal drink. Mm. Very delicious. Mm. With ginger, lemongrass, and lemon. Khao Lao is a special noodle dish from Hoi An, Vietnam. The dish features barbecue pork, fresh herbs, bean sprouts, and crispy rice crackers. It's a must try for experiencing the delicious flavor of Hoi An. It's like a rice noodle. There's so much flavor, just definitely a lot of texture happening, a lot of flavor happening. One go. I am in the middle of Hoi An just getting some uh, breakfast and I came across this local restaurant They sell omelette on a hot plate Ban Mi O Pla is a Vietnamese breakfast staple that combines a crispy baguette with a delicious omelette This popular street food typically includes a flavorful filling of eggs, virus meat and fresh herbs offering a delight mix of texture and flavor What's fresher than stopping at a beachside restaurant? Here you can order a variety of fresh seafood this grilled squid in particular was delightfully chewy in texture and dipping sauce is to die for. Mi Kwan means Kwan noodle, which is a noodle from central Vietnam. Mi Kwan is distinctive for its rich and flavorful broth made from simmering meat, commonly pork or chicken, and but aromatic spices. <laughs> Sweet, very sweet. In a good way. Mikwan is renowned for its vibrant colors, its diverse texture, and a harmonious blend of savory, sweet, and umami flavors. If you are in Vietnam, you cannot miss this dish. Bami is a Vietnamese sandwich that features a crispy baguette with a variety of savory ingredients. Bami queen where it's recommended by a friend as well as our hotel. So I'm gonna check out the bami. There's so much ingredients inside the bami. The combination of this element creates a delightful mix of flavors so and texture, making bami a very popular and beloved street food in Vietnam and beyond. Explore the delicious world of Hoi An Old Town at night. Wander through vibrant streets filled with tempting smells and bustling food vendors. From tasty savory dishes to sweet desserts, the options are endless. I'm having a winter melon tea. We just at a local bami and soy milk shop in the middle of the like 10 p.m. But they're still running and super busy. And super cheap bami is like 15k per combination. Ah, oh, mung yeah. bean, the green bean. Man bean. Uh, this one? Mm. Can I let it? Nine. Soy bean. And this one? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Corn. 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 Yeah. Uh, and this one? Yeah. I don't know, matcha or something. And this one? Pineapple, right? Um, go, can I let it? Pumpkin. Pumpkin. Oh, okay, thank you. You've got to try the dessert in Kuei particularly the che hui, which means sweet soup. Here we are trying corn, bean paste, mochi, and banana flavors. They are all super delicious. If you are a foodie like me, you'll like hui. Hui is super famous for its delicious and unique food. Okay, please. Mi quan is the pizza. Pizza, you book here, and you join together, and you eat, okay?
The Fui Hui reflects not only the great taste but also the city's rich culture and history. Rice cake and the, I don't know, the yellow bean stuff, and then there's some crunchy on top. <laughs> The bamboo flavor is like very strong. Wow, this one looks so beautiful. It's like a jelly of pork fat and shrimp. I can't wait to try it. Mm. Jello around it. Mm. Jelly is so true. So this one we put this lemongrass and break. Mm, it smells fresh. Everything. Like a cigarette cigar. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Really good. Mm. It's so crunchy. I think it's banana ice cream, but I thought it was a pancake. But... Central Vietnam offers endless list of flavors, and I savored every delicious bite. I hope you enjoyed the video as much as I enjoyed the food. Until next time, happy eating!